So this is Kubernetes, don't believe the hype. I am Hinata Hoshan. I am a DevOps consultant from Toronto. And uh, we are going to discuss whether Kubernetes is all that what we say. OK, so what is this? We are DevOps. Do we know things? Let's find out. Is Kubernetes good for you? Is it the right solution you are looking for? Uh, is it just marketing? Uh, what the fuck is Kubernetes? OK, what does it mean? OK, it's the Greek word for hell. And uh, it's an open source platform. It containerized work workloads and services. Uh, and if Google uses it, we all want to use it too, right? Well, um, I'm not really sure about it. Um, maybe? Uh, OK. Uh, some businesses are using Kubernetes very well, but we have to understand, is, is there anything wrong with our current infrastructure? Uh, we have to consider if your infrastructure is growing enough for you to use Kubernetes. Um, but the reality is that no, many people don't really need that. It's very complex. Maybe you don't have only two instances. Maybe you don't have the money to invest in it. Maybe. It's just not a good idea. Uh, it's a very promising technology, and people do tell you that it will solve everything. But uh, in some situations, it didn't work very well. You don't have a very complex infrastructure. You don't have enough time to invest. Um, if your infra is so small, uh, you're going to end up with a very complex Kubernetes infrastructure and just a blog hosted on it. OK. We've all seen that. But uh, if your schedule is too tight, you, don't have, you only have like a weekend to deploy your solution. Trust me, it's not going to work out. Even experienced developers will have a hard time deploying a Kubernetes solution. If your infra is unique, okay, you're going to have a lot of problems to solve and not enough time to train your team. Um, maybe it's just more work than actual results. Um, the thing is that Kubernetes is too complex. It's famous for that. And uh, you know what? There's a lot of gatekeeping, and people think they're too smart, and that's why they like Kubernetes. Uh, you cannot underestimate the time, the cost, and the knowledge required to deploy it. But the internet told me I need it, OK? OK, Google told the internet you need it, because it works for Google. Uh, but uh, unfortunately, most of us here are not Google yet, maybe someday, but uh, uh, our infrastructures are not that big. <laughs> uh, Google told you that you needed lots of things, right? I rest my case, Your Honor. <laughs> okay, what now? Uh, we have to understand what needs to be done, we have to compare everything that we have, there are other solutions available, and then when we implement it, we have to implement the best, the most cost effective, the, what offers the best results, there are other things that uh, are going to offer us. Um, it works for many people, and I actually really like it when it works. Like eBay is doing a very good solution based on Kubernetes, but like eBay is big, right? Nordstrom, Nokia, you can read many case studies of success. Um, the thing is that say no to peer pressure, okay? Uh, when your marketing team, when your friends tell you to use it, you are able to say no when it doesn't work for what you have right now. Uh. The closing. Okay, the major idea is that a Kubernetes migration is a very impactful thing in your current infrastructure, and you have to analyze what you currently have to see. Okay, don't do it because it's cool. Don't do it because you're pressure, and you don't do most importantly before proper research. Um, the changes you are going to implement are going to have long-lasting effects, and they are going to bite you back on the bottom if they are not going to be done properly. You have to treat your infrastructure with love. You have to treat your infrastructure with care. Your infrastructure are going to love you back. Kubernetes is hard. Kubernetes costs money, despite being an open source, because there is an investment. And Kubernetes, most importantly, is not Jesus. It's not going to save the world, OK? It's just a tool. Thank you very much. I'm Renata.org, and this is Kubernetes, and don't believe the Kubernetes hype.